is how to make a test tube set up like this one to put your ants in it. First you get a normal test tube. You will also need some cotton and a skewer, a wooden skewer. You want to fill this up with water to about this high. If you get too much, you can just pour it out. There we go. So you want to get your cotton and get a little bit of cotton like this. Roll it into a ball. Now you can get a cotton, little piece of cotton, and put it at the top. Then you can use your skewer to slowly put it down. When you get to the water, you want to hold your test tube straight up and down, and then slowly go down. And you'll notice that the water, the cotton ball soaks up the water and you keep going till there's no air below it now this is where it gets tricky if you get water like this above your cotton ball you don't want that so what you do to grab the cotton is you get your skewer and you break it so you get these frayed edges then you put that down to the cotton and twist and then you're able to grasp the cotton again. You want to try and get no air back there. But it's okay if there's a few bubbles, that's fine. If you have some bubbles there and you have no way of getting them up, then you can try to get your skewer and push the cotton out of the way so the air can come up. Or you can just leave it there. After you've done that, you just give it a little test. See if there's any water coming out, make sure it's all tight. In my case, it's all good. Then you can get another piece of cotton about the same size and just use it to cap it off. And you don't have to worry about um, ants getting out, they can't burrow through this. And they will have enough air in there, they have enough air there, and some air can get through the cotton. So you don't have to worry about them uh, having difficulties breathing or anything. And there you go. You can catch a queen, you can take this out, try and catch a or usually what I do is I just use an empty uh, test tube to catch them or a container and then you move them into these and put a heat cable about there if you have one or just put it in a hot room because ants need heat. As you might know if you've um, gone into this hobby. So there it is, how to make a test tube set up. Make sure to like, comment and subscribe. See you next time.